hey my loves welcome to my channel today we're gonna spend the entire day together you guys are gonna see what i eat in a day and i'm gonna bring you guys to the gym with me stay tuned so if you've been watching me you already know that the first thing that i like to do in the morning is have my herbalite tea this tea is great because it burns between 80 to 100 calories in every cup i also add my collagen beauty booster which is even better because it helps with your hair skin and nails you know we all need that and i add my apple fiber complex which is amazing if you suffer from like constipation or bloating it just helps flush you out so i love this product and then i steal the deal with the herbal life concentrate which also is great for your digestive health and it adds an amazing flavor this is in the cranberry flavor so you can either have this hot or cold as you can tell i enjoy having mine hot and i never ever forget to have my cellulose tablets in the morning because they get rid of that water weight as well as my vitamins you guys need your vitamins especially when you're in a weight loss journey you want to make sure you're getting your nutrients so that's what i have in the morning let's go to the gym you guys So y'all know that I'm on a weight loss journey. So the first thing that you need to do when you go to the gym is put on your waist trainer, girl. Look at how much I've been sweating just from wearing this. It definitely helps mold you as you are losing weight and we all know that we want a snatched waist. So definitely wear your waist trainer. Hey my loves, Mariela here. Welcome back to my channel. If you click this video, I'm assuming you wanna lose weight or you're starting your weight loss journey or you wanna learn a few workouts. This workout is amazing because you can do it at home as long as you have some dumbbells. So make sure that you try it and if you do, let me know how you enjoy it in the comments below. For the start of this workout, I am gonna use this machine right here. So I plan on burning about 250 calories on this one. Normally I would use the Stairmaster, but you know you have to switch it up so you don't plateau. Then afterwards, I am going to go on the treadmill on an incline, the highest incline at a 3.0, and I plan on burning between 100 to 150 calories on there. And then we are going to do a arm workout. Okay, so we're gonna start off this workout with some front extensions. I had seven pounders, but you choose the weight that you can handle. And I started off with doing, I think, 12 or 15. You do as much as you can, but keep in mind, we're gonna be doing two sets of this entire circuit. Oh my god you guys this exercise hurts so bad but remember that pain is good pain means that it's working take breaks where you need to take breaks but keep pushing who else makes super ugly faces when they're lifting at the gym if you ain't making ugly faces you ain't working sis And these scarecrow extensions, oh my god, do not underestimate this workout because I promise you're going to be sore for the next two days. Like, I literally feel like I was hit by a truck. Can you tell I was dying, y'all? Because I was dying. And 
and this one right here is good for your chest i still feel it on my chest two days later super painful super effective highly recommend And now I'm doing some side curls, easy peasy lemon squeezy. We've been doing these since we were like eight years old, so you can't mess these up. We're doing some overhead extensions. All right, I'm going to need you guys not to laugh at me while I'm doing these shoulder shrugs. Like, I don't know what I was doing, but I learned from my mistakes. So that's why it's good to film yourself. So you can watch yourself afterwards and you can see what you need to fix. You can adjust your posture. I'm telling you guys, you got to learn from your mistakes. I'm learning from mine. Remember, I'm not a trainer or anything like that. I'm just showing you what works for me. So don't judge me, please. And now we're going to repeat the entire workout all over again.
So lately, something that I've been doing is finishing off all my workouts with ab exercises just so I can accelerate the process of eliminating this little pop belly that I have going on. So these are some of the abdominal exercises that I like to do. And of course, we're wrapping up our workout with a stretch, super important. Now, I'm dying to get home so I can have my yummy, delicious Herbalife shake and break my fast. so i am back home from my workout i burned let's see i burned 650 calories and i just want to show you guys how amazing this waist trainer is well it's kind of like a swap belt not a waist trainer look at that that is crazy you guys if you want to get rid of water weight on your abs and your back and your sides i recommend one of these Alrighty guys, so it is now about to be 1 o'clock in the afternoon and I am breaking my fast. And to break my fast, as you know, I am having my Herbalife shake. The first thing that I'm going to do is add water to my blender. I already have my ice in there as well. And then I am going to add one scoop of my protein. This is going to sustain me and keep me full for the next two to three hours. And I am going to add my formula one in banana caramel. I'm gonna add two scoops of that. And this has all the vitamins and nutrients that your body needs. And it tastes so, so good, so good. This is actually one of my favorites. And as you guys know, I'm also going to add some cinnamon. I love to break my fast with my shake because it doesn't hit heavy on me, but it does keep me full. It's low calorie, so it allows me to ease into what I'm gonna be eating next. So let me blend it now. So I blended my shake for about 30 to 60 seconds, making sure everything is nice and well blended. And I'm pouring it inside of my cup. Ooh, I've, I still have some left. I'm gonna drink it. Can't waste it. And I love to top my shake with some Prolessa. I love the Prolessa because it fills me up. The Prolessa is amazing because it burns abdominal fat and it is an appetite suppressant. So this is a must have if you're on a weight loss journey. Mm, 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 mm. Breaking my fast with my Herbalife shake. For the ones wondering why we add the Prolessa to the top of the shake like this is because it actually tastes like baby formula. Mm 
it feels like you're eating a snack. A lot of people in the herbalist community do this. Mm -hmm. So after my shake, I'm now having a snack and I just got two plain rice cakes and I added some avocado on the top. I made the avocado myself just with some onions and some lemon juice and I mashed it all together. Super easy, super simple. Don't complicate your life. I'm now adding some everything bagel seasoning and I fried an egg and I'm putting half of an egg on one rice cake and the other half on another rice cake and now I'm adding some pepper and that is the finished product 356 calories you guys and of course I'm having an entire water bottle with that so now it is lunchtime and I'm going to have this amazing pizza. It's a low fat pizza and you can have it as a snack. That's how low calorie it is. But today I'm having it for lunch because I don't have a big appetite. So the first thing that we're going to do is grab a wrap. I'm using a wheat wrap and I'm going to spray it with some extra olive virgin oil right here. Then you can use whatever pizza sauce you want and spread it on that tortilla and this is what I mean when I say get creative with your food this right here is tasty it's like a pizza but it has all the healthy nutrients that your body needs And I am adding some broccoli to my pizza. The cool thing about pizza is that you can basically make it however you want. It's awesome. And I'm adding a lot of broccoli because something cool about vegetables is that you can add a lot of them because they're extremely low in calorie. They have so many nutrients and the volume just fills you up a lot. And I want to be really full with low calories so that's the whole purpose of being in a caloric deficit and i'm also adding some onions i add onions to almost everything onions make things taste yummy so that's why i added that and of course i am adding some cheese my favorite kind of cheese is the mexican blend because it's a mixture of a whole bunch of cheeses and your girl loves cheese and you can also get the cheese fat free so make sure to look around for that And I'm also adding some avocado because I went to California Pizza and I saw that they did this and I tried it and I never turned back. I love adding avocado to my pizzas. And some garlic powder for taste. And some everything bagel seasoning. I literally add that on everything. And last but not least, I'm adding some Parmesan cheese and I kind of added a little bit too much, but it's okay. Mm -mm -mm. Look at how that looks. Now I am going to put it inside my toaster oven at 350 degrees for about 10 minutes. And ta-da! This is what it looks like when you take it out of the oven, ladies. It is so yummy. And also keep in mind that you can replace any of these vegetables with your favorite vegetables. So you can add a lot of red peppers and green peppers and spinach. You can add mushrooms. You can literally make it however you want. And it's a much healthier alternative to pizza. I definitely enjoyed this one. So I also wanted to show you guys something that I have been snacking on a lot and it is these built Bars. I actually purchased the whole box because I wanted to try all the flavors. These are trending on YouTube right now because they taste amazing so I do recommend them if you're interested in purchasing them. I will include the link below but they come in an array of different flavors. This one is coconut almond and it only has 
This one is only 180 calories. That flavor is bomb. Then this one is the salted caramel, which I love. And this one is only 130 calories. So you get a lot of different flavors. I've also been enjoying these fruit and salted nut Kellogg's protein bars as well. I highly recommend these. You can get these at any supermarket. But yeah, that is something that I snack on as well. And I wanted to make sure that I mentioned it because they are bomb and they are low calorie and they taste amazing. And we want amazing things in our diet. So this is definitely an option. I recommend that you guys look into it.